Hello Cancer, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your messages from Spirit Reading. It will be for April 2021 for the sign of Cancer. So let's get straight into your reading and pull your overarching energy or message for the month of April. What do we have for Cancer please, Angels? Spirit's Guides, message for our lovely Cancerians. Thank you, your card has fallen out, or three cards I should say. Let's go with it. So I have oh, two cards, Trust the divine plan think things through if you're losing perspective this month the message is just regroup trust think something through before acting on it speaking acting okay message for Cancer, please, angels, spirits, guides, message for our lovely Cancerians. I'm going to pull a few oracle cards. Remember, it doesn't resonate with everybody, so just take what resonates with you, Cancer, for April 2021. Thank you. You know, when I see this energy, it's like it's reasons to be thankful here. So I've got gratitude. Life is one big continuous circle of giving and receiving energy. Be thankful for who and what's in your life instead of complaining about what you don't have. If you focus on gratitude, you'll start to attract prosperity and abundance. Okay. Message for our lovely Cancerians, please, for April 2021. Thank you. Card is out. Again, we have uh, this distraction energy. So number one, align your universe, navigate distractions. Again, an energy of think things through, get perspective before you speak or do something. And again, there's, there's definitely an energy of look how far you've come, you know, for some of you. Okay. Message for our lovely Cancerians, please. Message for our lovely Cancerians. April 2021. Two cards there. Okay. Oh, Raven, prepare for change. Archangels, Azriel and Bokpi. And we have Swan, demonstrate grace and majesty. Archangel Bokpi again. Um... Isn't that beautiful? So lovely energies there, Cancer. Let's pull some cards, get more specific messages. Remember, these are just messages from spirit, messages and advice. So message for our lovely Cancerians, please. Message for our Cancerians, thank you. From spirit, April 2021, please. What do we have for cancer thank you message for cancer april 2021 thank you eight of swords nine of cups the hermit bottom of the deck we have the eight of pentacles It's interesting that I was talking about reasons to be thankful because that's this. Uh, that is the Nine of Cups. Yeah, I mean, Cancer. Okay, the message from Spirit. What Spirit is picking up on in your energy is the Eight of Swords. So there's a message here. The Swords energy is to do with the mind, how we perceive something, communication, our perception. Uh, thought patterns and how they can keep us stuck. This is the mind holding you prisoner, holding you hostage because it, it feels uh, this is about self-limiting beliefs, self-limiting uh, vocalizations, 
you know, I can't do that because of this, um, this is never going to happen, the situation's futile, you know, it's all these kind of things. Um, our own internal energy can hold us hostage, limit our progress. And Spirit is recognising that this is about thinking things through, getting perspective and trusting the divine plan, 12th house energy, 9 of cups, which is the house of Spirit. Um, because the message is don't think that your hope, dream and wish isn't available to you because it is. But you need to get perspective. You need to think things through. There is an opportunity. There is change coming. Prepare for change. Navigate distraction energy on focusing on negative things that will only keep you limited and stuck. There is definitely an energy here, Cancer, of if you really focus your mind, the red hat, sometimes this is shown as a red hat, which is very much about switch your mind on positive energy, uh, action energy, mental acuity, applying your mental acuity in a positive way. You can bring a sense of achievement your way this month. This is your wish coming true. This is reasons to be thankful. Celebration feeling content, aligning to where you need to be, align to your universe, this is alignment, align where spirit is leading you towards, but in this energy, you know, this is blocking this, so just be careful of how you're perceiving something this month, vocalizing something, because this can be the limiting energy that stops us from really achieving our hopes, dreams and wishes, and that is available to you. Uh, there's definitely an energy of you're going to get your wish, your hope, dream and wish, but just deal with this energy here. Yeah. And again, the hermit energy is really connecting to source from within. You know, the, the lamp is source, God, the divine, the universe speaking to you, uh, giving you guidance, answers, knowledge on how you need to take action in your external environment. And the, the Hermit is an alignment energy. Um, it's a lovely, lovely energy, the Hermit, raising your vibration from within. So it definitely feels for some of you there is something to do with this vibrational energy that is limiting and needs to be released in some way, shape or form. Because when you do cancer, I mean, the eight of, you know, this is about putting that energy, not to keeping your, your, yourself stuck, but putting your energy, small steps bring giant leaps, working through it, being productive, doing the mundane practical things that you need to do. And slowly but surely you bring gain into your life. The eight of, of pentacles is a card of financial gain and mastery. Um, can be a card of learning new skills, can be a card of education, getting qualifications, um, internships, apprenticeships, um, but it's also a card of just work through it, focus your energy in a practical, positive way, and slowly but surely you will bring positive change. Because as this person chisels the star, you know, the star that you're illuminated to focus on, you know, there's a star in that hermit lamp um, it's almost like the illumination from within is telling you how to practically apply it this is Virgo as well in your external environment you are aligning to greater value bringing greater value and success material gain in particular into your life um, can be about recognition getting some recognition notice more money um, but working through something and doing what you do well very good in terms of money, career, finances. Small steps bring giant leaps and is linked to this, getting some kind of hope, dream and wish. So it feels very beautiful here, Cancer. Yeah, I've got the Ace of Cups, which is about emotional renewal. Um, emotional rebirth, new beginnings can be in terms of opportunity, offers, love. I mean, it can be love, can be to do with 
uh, money career, uh, what you've been working towards, uh, can be to do with friendships, pets, call it what you will. But the Ace of Cups is the universe showing you love, showing you positive energy, showing you light, love. And there's definitely an energy of the new beginning is available to you. Just work through something here. Um, and it's bringing you some kind of hope, dream and wish. This is within your grasp. There's an energy of prepare for change. But it's almost kind of like, don't let something make you think small this month. Yeah. Small steps bring giant leaps this month. Stay focused, grounded, apply your practical skills, knowledge, experience, and you'll see the difference. You start shaping your own reality. So we have your intuition is strong. We are reaching out to help. Yeah. That's the help coming your way. Yeah. Lovely energy, Cancer. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful month for you all and I will see you next time. Thank you.